Hello, it's Phil Thatch and I'm here on the side of the Teleco River, just upstream from Teleco Plains, Tennessee. This is a waterfall known as Baby Falls and I've made a few uh, shots of it with my Nikon Z6 and the 24 to 70 f 2.8G lens. I've got my new five stop ND filter which also has a built-in circular polarizer in the same filter and I've made a few shots of that and I'm actually here uh, my friend and co-worker Kobe George is here with his family and they're going to be kayaking this area they've put in a pretty good ways upstream so now that I've made a few shots of this waterfall I'm going to set up for some action photography of them as they come through Here's a little bit of Z6 25% speed slow motion video of Baby Falls. And then here is a up close black and white quarter second speed to smooth out the water shot of the main section of the falls. And then the next shot, that one's 70 and this one's 44 millimeters. And I had the camera a little bit higher on the hill of kind of the full Baby Falls. And you can't really tell in this picture how tall it is, but you'll be able to tell in some of the video later. I brought lots and lots of gear with me, but I think I'm going to just stay with this setup with the 24 to 70 on the Z6 to get uh, slow motion video of them after they, as they come off of Baby Falls. And I've got the FTZ adapter and the 24 to 70, I mean, excuse me, the 70 to 200 F 2.8. And I'm gonna use a really high shutter speed uh, to try to freeze them as they come off in stills with this rig. So now it's just time to wait Okay, so let's do some 25% speed slow motion with the Z6 of the boys coming over Baby Falls. Here comes Kobe coming right at it. And I don't know a thing about kayaking, but that seems completely awesome to me. Strangely, Kobe's hair did not get wet, uh, or not significantly wet anyway, even after that amazing plunge. And if you look at the top of the rapids, you can see... Kobe's little brother Bennett is on the way down. Look at Kobe's smile. He is so stoked after that, and I don't blame him. That has to be amazingly fun. Here comes Bennett, getting closer now. Looks like he's trying to get set up just right and to that one spot where, where apparently the line is. Here he comes. Splash. How awesome is that? Okay, now that was Z6 video, and the next section of video is the same run, but this is normal speed with a GoPro mounted in the hot shoe on top of my camera. And you can even see the 70 to 200 lens that I was using in the bottom of the frame. And you can hear the shutter. It, it does 11 frames per second, the Z50 does, and you can hear it in this. 11 frames per second is very fast. Uh, unfortunately, the buffer in the camera is really small. Here comes Bennett. So the buffer fills up really quick. All right, these are the shots that I liked enough to share with you. There's Kobe at the top looking down and getting ready. And here he is just about to take off and make his way down Baby Falls and the next shot he is well on his way uh, getting soaking wet unbelievable the next shot he had kinda gotten a little bit ahead of me and he was about to be out of frame but I still kinda liked it I cropped it square uh, so you can see how far he is down and the next shot he's made it to the bottom and he is basically underwater completely that GoPro camera that's orange there is on top of his helmet and now here is Bennett, working on his line, getting ready to come down. Uh, I, I, the buffer in my camera, I had filled it many times and I had to just kind of pick and choose my shots because it hadn't fully cleared by the time Bennett came down. But I still managed to get some fairly good ones, including this next one, which may be the best picture of the entire day, except for I think I caught Bennett blinking in this one. I like it when my subject's eyes are open. And this next one's cropped quite a bit, but... Uh, I really like that and of course I cut off the front of Bennett's boat and then the next photograph is uh, 
him coming up like a like a bobber just right back up because Bennett's pretty light I would say I think he's only 12 or 13 years old all right now we're gonna check out the brothers as they go through diaper wiper that's the name of this rapid according to Kobe Really shrunk down my rig now I've just got the GoPro with the Rode Wireless Go uh, audio system mounted on top of the Z50 with the 50 to 250 kit lens now I'm leaving all the rest in the car I'm kind of hustling down to to the next rapid uh, the boys dad said this was a class 4 rapid so should be pretty cool and uh, I'm I'm parked at the pullout and I'm walking back to try to get some more shots with the Z50, this time with a kit lens instead of a exotic 7200 f2.8. Okay, so I've scaled this uh, side of the road here and I've got a pretty good vantage point of this rapid. I can't remember what he said it was. Jared's Run or Nomad's Testicles. I'm not sure, something crazy and uh, only thing about it that's not good is there's a few branches that might be a little bit in my way, but I think it's going to be okay. Here they come. I can see them in the distance. Looks like they're waiting to start it. I'm shooting uh, wide open, which it varies everywhere from 4.5 to 6.3. Automatic ISO, manual shutter speed, 1 4,000th. This must be the class four rapid right here. Kobe has made it down. Let's see what little brother does. <laughs> Good job! Woohoo! Here are the stills that I just made, and there they come. Kobe's making his way down, and here he is continuing to make his way down. I like this shot a, a lot. I'm really kind of happy with that one. And here comes Bennett making his way down. Bennett really gets a lot of uh, a lot of air, I guess, because he's pretty light and really working it to keep the bow of his boat up it looks like he's leaning back trying to keep the the uh, nose from going in and he did well because it didn't here comes Kobe 
concentrating, getting ready for the next set of rapids. And on this next shot, Kobe has just made it around a rock and he was really concentrating before and uh, the shots weren't that great, but on this one he's smiling and happy uh, and thrilled to have made it. And here he is just about to go off another one and that is Jared's knee on the Teleco River. All right, well that was fun. I'm gonna go down here and try to get a word with the boys when they pull their boats out. Just a couple hundred yards down the road here. Guys, tell me how was it here at, uh, what's this place called? This yeah, is Teleco. Tel uh, Teleco River. And what was that last one? I call it Nomad's Testicle or something. <laughs> what is it? Jared's Knee. Jared's Knee, there we go. That was great. Enjoyed uh, watching you guys go down the river. And uh, I really appreciate it. Shoot you. Thank you. Thanks for taking the time to watch the video. Hope you have a great day. And I look forward to seeing you hopefully in the next one. If you like the content, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe and hit the bell. And we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.